guys welcome back in today's video we're going to be going over my new nail space and i know you have been seeing samples of this space because you know my previous videos i've been filming down here but i wanted to show you guys a more general view of everything and details of new things that i have in this new space that i didn't have upstairs um and then there's a bunch of stuff that's being reused and furniture that i was given like for free to just um, how do you call this? Repurpose? And I just painted it and changed the hardware plus some furniture like this back here that used to be in my kids playroom and things like that. So let's just go over it real quick. I'm going to flip my camera and show you guys everything and that's it. All right. So this is how the space looks like. Okay. And then let's go into detail here. So this piece of furniture that you guys are seeing here, I got it from my sister-in-law. It was the color of the legs. You know, but I actually was lazy and didn't want to paint the legs. So I didn't want to move the whole furniture outside. So <laughs> I just painted the top. I was like, nobody cares about the legs, whatever. And then so there's a lot of storage here that I didn't have upstairs because this whole, you know, piece of furniture is brand new. So what I have here, it's mainly just supplies and my gel nail polish with my um, gel supplies. And then down here, just acetone and other stuff. Then in these three drawers, I don't really have anything nail related. It's just my purse and some, you know, this is room for growth. I have some, my hard drives and some like um, gadgets and shit here. And then down here, this drawer almost doesn't open all the way, but I just have like tape and a measuring thing, just random things. So this is room for growth. And then over here, I have some more supplies. I think I don't even know. Yeah, paper towel and a little mess down here, something to clean and, um, I have my Glisten and Glow brushes that you guys know. I love the white ones. Um, and just some, you know, minor stuff in here. All right, that corner only has gadgets and stuff, and there's a fan over there. So this is not too pretty. <laughs> then we have my desk, and this is the same desk that I had upstairs, but I have a new chair. My friend Kathy actually, uh, I was looking for a chair, and I was like, I want a white chair. And she's like, what about this one? I was like, it looks pretty. And I bought it right there and there, and it came like, in a, in a box, you know, from Amazon and just like put it together myself. But it's really, really comfy and I like it. And they have it in a bunch of different colors and combinations. So I love the chair. That's new. Desk is not new. And then this is the same organizing thing that I had upstairs as well. Everything here is the same, except this, which is just one of those shelves that the same ones that I have over here. But I grabbed this one recently just to organize my desk because otherwise this mess of polish that I'm either working on or have to, you know, new PR or things that I'm just, I don't know, using for comparisons like you see down here, it was a mess. So I was like, okay, let me get one of those shelves so I can put it here and <laughs> organize things a little bit better. And then we go into the actual nail polish storage. All my nail polish is here. Let me um, zoom out the camera a little bit so you guys can see it better here a lot of light coming from that window so anyways let me explain to you guys what's going on here plan number one plan number two they're from home depot and this i've had it for a long time but this one i bought it specifically for this spot right here uh, and then you guys if you remember i used to have um a helmer which i still have it upstairs i plan to use it for just archive whenever i have to move things out that i don't use or that are older that i don't use for comparisons or whatever it's gonna go upstairs in the helmer but for now i have everything in an alex just because it matches this piece of furniture so i kind of switched you know i used to have this in my actual work office so i switched it down here and now i store polish in here and then this four by four um what is this called? I don't know. It's from Ikea as well. It used to live in my kid's playroom and then it moved into my son's room and nobody was going to use it. Ooh, this is messed up. You know, it must be organized. <laughs> um, and then I just took it and I said, okay, if nobody wants it, I'm going to use it and I'm going to find a way to store polish in here. So that's, that's how this came about. And then it so happened that these shelves fit perfectly in here and it's perfect to grab things. I still have room to put some light up here if I want to, because right now I don't have, it's just either natural light or I have to, you know, bring out my flash to see the colors properly at night. But during the day you can see them pr pretty well, but I'm still going to put some light at the top of the cubes, you know, so that it's, it, it should be nicer that way. Okay. So over here in this corner is just my dimension nails. This shelf, I still had it upstairs, so it's the same. Now, as you can see, it's getting full. So once this gets full, we'll see what, what I do with them and who I put in here. But for now, it has my dimensional nails. 
And then, um, let me see, start from up here. Up here I have my Eternal polishes, my Glam polishes, Olive Bath polishes, and all my Zoyas. And now, as you can see, this is also running out of space soon. But these little ones are a dollar from the Dollar Tree. So I can just expand, you know, and add more because um, these little squares don't fit that many polishes. They fit the Soyas, they fit the Olive Ave, but they don't really fit Essies or anything that's a little bit bigger. Like it fits some Essies, but in some squares it doesn't go in, you know? So this, this big one does fit everything. OPI, Orly, Morgan Taylor, the square bottles, everything fits in this one. So I really, really love these shelves. I'm very glad I had, you know, I got those. Um, I got that recommendation from my friend Kathy and, my, and another friend of mine, Alex. They also use this shelf, so I knew they loved them. So I tried them and loved it as well and just bought the rest of them. So as you can see, this first row is all my Essies. And then down here, I have all my OPIs. And there's room for more over here, so I'm leaving that empty on purpose. <laughs> then in this corner, I have all my China glazes, which is also about to get full, but we'll figure that out. And then here I have my Orleys, and there's room there for new collections. And then we come into my Alex, and let me show you this clip-on set. If you guys saw it on my Instagram, this is for my daughter, and this is gonna be for me, because we're going on a mini vacation with the family. So I was like, we're gonna have you know, nice, pretty long nails, and I just did those sets for us, so. Oh, and this little, what is this, cubbies? I don't know, I think that's what it's called, the little drawer things, yeah, cubbies. It just holds like supplies, and then down here I have some things like, some packaging that I saved that looks like it will be good for the future, you know, to just reuse it. And then I have random things like cables and whatever, it's just, um, just storage down here. And then up here, I also um, have the Donald Duck. If you guys remember, that used to be my nail room upstairs. It's the only thing that I owned from when I was a kid from Cuba. My, my grandmother bought it and not bought it, brought it. I don't really know where we got this from. I don't know if it belonged to her own kids when they were little. I don't know. It just so happened that it's the only thing I own. So I don't know. I always kept it. And then back here, we have some, um, let me see, this is not okay. focusing. My daughter made those three, and we had them somewhere in our, our living room, and I told my husband, I was like, that looks like nail polish. I am stealing this three for my nail room, and I think they look great. You guys think? And she made them like two, three years ago. So I was like, okay, that's pretty good. I'll be using those. <laughs> Let's take a quick tour of my Alex to see what's in here. So just a bunch of like glitter and bling and stickers and a bunch of like nail art stuff. And then these are my midi brushes. <laughs> and then here we have a bunch of um, brands that I don't have that many of them. You know, like those <laughs> where I have a lot. Um, they're in here. And then the next drawer we have, what are these? My Nail Bazaar, Morgan Taylor's, Flormar, Sinful Colors, and the ones from Hot Topic with the skull bottles <laughs> very nice and then down here we have oops sorry these are orosa ko polish koki i think these are la colors bunch of them on polishes we have glisten and glow that's it i don't have anything else in this drawer all right this last drawer holds my color clubs and there's some more space back there so there's nothing else here color club and these from um, Paris Hilton, which I just kept because the bottles are super nice and they're metallic pretty good They probably don't last that much, but they're super pretty to wear like if you don't care and just want to wear it for like a day yeah, I don't know. They're cute <laughs> Now if you can see here, there's one two, eight of these and I they come completely, you know They don't come built like this. I have to build every one of them by hand and this little Screws or whatever. Why is this thing not focusing? God damn. These little screws, I had to put them one by one. So at some point my hand hurt from building all of these, but you know, I'm very happy with them, so. Oh, and let me show you, they fit, let me see. Let me see how many, what is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So 60 SEs, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, times six is 48, 48 OPI. So you get an idea more or less, you know, where you can fit in one of these. 
Also, regarding these, um, these shelves, I don't know if you guys remember that I had them upstairs and I had one vertical and one was horizontal. And then I realized that I wanted them both, both to be vertical and I gave them to my cousin, who's the one that built them originally for me. And I was like, can you please turn this, you know, turn this frown upside down? <laughs> I was like, can you just change it? And so he took it and he like rearranged it so that now they're both vertical. And this little wooden thing that my friend Cindy gave to me a very long time ago, um, when I started my page, it used to be wooden. It was so much more prettier than in white, but it broke like three times and we had to glue it. And then you could see the glue. So I was like, okay, I'm going to paint it white, even though I prefer how it was originally, but that's fine. Uh, someday I'll just add color, maybe a gradient or something. So that it pops a little bit more. That's it for my nail room. Let me know if you guys like this video. If there's any area here that you guys want to see more detail on, let me know in the comments below and we'll go back and do another video on that area. But that's it. Other than that, thank you guys for watching and I'll catch you next time. Bye.